Yes, was pleased and would like to meet you again. Is that a good thing? Of course, although I'm starting to think that Diaz was responsible for our unfortunate loss. What makes you say that? One does not wave accusations at a man like Diaz. I'm merely thinking out loud, no matter. I have a proposal that you could profit. I don't have time to run more errands, Cortez. I would have thought a man with such dangerous dates would be hungry for opportunities. Please, Tommy, at least hear me out. Go on. I have a buyer for a piece of military hardware that is being taken through town. Pick it up for me. And once you get it, I want you to call me immediately. Then... Drive through fast food and commemorative plates. Take that money right now and send it. Direct to me, Jonathan Freeloader, Starfish Island, Vice City. Oh, now, back oh. to the show with Maurice Chavez, the asshole. You're correct. He is an asshole. I'm Maurice Chavez. Welcome back. Damn. I used to be a performance clown. Now, I'm running a debate show. Funny how things turn out, eh? <laughs> or is it? That's the question, you see. If we look upon life as a positive experience, do we make it any better? That's what we're discussing right now here on Pressing Issues. Free radio with free ideas. Just keep those donations pouring in. Don't sell out to corporations. We all need a voice. Really, we do. And today, right now, we're giving a voice to three very different people discussing positive thinking. A healthy mental attitude. We've got a goth depressive. We've got a very happy orphan. And we've got a motivational speaker with a number of systems. So let's start with you, Constantinos, you strange, creepy creature of darkness. Have you got a positive mental attitude? I like to think so. Oh, really? Misery and suffering, it's everywhere, man. And I actively want a fatal disease. What bad can possibly happen to me? You could win the lottery. The lottery? That's for people with hope. I don't enter the lottery. You could. Damn, you, you two, help me here. I think he's great. I think he's really sweet. I love your hair. It reminds me of a big shaggy dog with long, greasy, straight hair. You know, Chavez, this weird goth guy, he's got a point. I mean, in many ways, what he's talking about is covered in my three-step program, Tape 17. Motivate, demonstrate, then motivate again, part nine. Facing home truths. You see, we all have to face up to a few home truths. I'll never be prom queen. Jenny will never have her parents. You'll never make it in the entertainment business. It's about realistic goals. I can change your life. And, uh, just a second, robot. What isn't covered in your three-step program? What don't you talk about in your Library of congress size tape cassette library? Whatever we talk about, grief, goths, depression, changing lives. Who are you? What have you done that's... Go get some donuts, soldier. Sir, yes, sir. Convoy, halt. Civilian, move away from the tank! Civilian, tank, stop it! Defensive positions! 